Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the brand new Ray-Ban Aviator Clear Evolve Sunglasses. So the model number of these is the Ray-Ban RB3025. And that model number, of course, is the exact same as the classic Ray-Ban Aviator Sunglasses. They both are the Ray-Ban RB3025. So the only difference between these two frames, of course, are gonna be these brand new Clear Evolve lenses. Of course, most of you guys know, I reviewed those classic Ray-Ban Aviator Sunglasses a ton of different times. So today, we're just gonna be talking about the new lenses on these Clear Evolve sunglasses. So these are Ray-Ban's Clear 2 Gray Photochromic lenses. So that means that they're actually gonna change depending on the lighting situation that you are in. So right now I am indoors with these bright studio lights that are lighting me up. And as you guys can see here, the lenses are perfectly clear because I'm in an indoor environment and these lights thankfully are not outputting harmful UV rays. So when you're wearing these sunglasses indoors, they're going to be basically perfectly clear and they're going to give that really cool eyeglass look to them. But when you walk outside of these frames into UV light, these sunglass lenses are actually going to darken and turn more gray than they are clear. So if these frames Ray-Ban set out to create a pair of sunglasses that somebody could wear all day long and they would never have to take off. So of course, with a standard pair of Ray-Ban Aviator sunglasses, you really can't wear them indoors because they really darken your vision a ton and they're just not going to be really practical. But here with these clear evolve lenses, as you guys can see here, they look very much like eyeglasses. So you're not going to get those weird looks and also they are very practical. You can wear these all day and not have to worry about your vision being dark when you're indoors. But in theory with these sunglasses, when you walk outside, they're going to darken and turn more gray. And because of that, you're not going to need a traditional pair of sunglasses. So these are going to be great for indoors and outdoor use. So that's the theory behind these sunglass frames. Let's see how they actually perform in the real world. Well, right now I'm indoors and they're doing a great job. They're not darkening. I can see everything just as good as I could see without them on. And they also look really, really good. So as far as indoors goes, they perform very well. Now, as far as how they perform outdoors, Unfortunately, they don't perform as good as I'd like them to. So for example, I was wearing these sunglasses indoors and then I immediately walked out into a very bright environment where the sun was shining directly on my face and I was squinting a lot. They really didn't do much to protect my eyes from the sun. They do, of course, block 100% UVA and UVB rays, but unfortunately, I was squinting a lot and it wasn't very comfortable. It took around 30 seconds to a minute for the lenses to fully darken, and even still, I was still squinting a lot more than I would with a traditional pair of Ray-Ban sunglasses. So I popped on my classic pair of Ray-Ban aviator sunglasses when I was outside in the same lighting environment, and as soon as I popped on these originals with G15 lenses, my eyes were able to relax and I wasn't squinting nearly as much as I was with these sunglasses even at their fully darkened state. So that leads me to my conclusion. These are really cool sunglasses and they definitely do darken but unfortunately in bright lighting situations they're not going to darken enough so these are going to be best for you know overcast or cloudy days. They're not going to be great for direct harsh sunlight. Okay, so I just walked into the studio from outside in direct sunlight, and as you guys can see here, the sunglasses definitely darkened, and they are more gray than they are clear. It takes about 30 seconds to a minute for them to go from fully dark to fully clear, or from fully clear to fully dark. So as you guys can see, just since I've been filming this video, which is 25 seconds so far, you can see they are definitely lighter than they were when I first started filming this clip. So these sunglass lenses do a good job at changing over pretty quickly. I guess if you want to wear a pair of sunglasses like this at school and you're just walking from your dorm to your classroom and you're kind of walking in shade and not in direct sunlight, these might be able to get the job done, but these really don't work as well as I wanted them to. And because of that, I really can't recommend them, especially considering the price is $184. That's really steep for a pair of sunglasses that you're squinting constantly in when you are wearing these in direct sunlight. However, they are still really, really cool. I do like how they do darken when you walk outside and they are definitely better than not wearing anything. And of course they do block 100% UVA and UVB rays. So when you are walking outside of these sunglasses, they are blocking all those harmful rays, which is also extremely important. And it's much better to wear these and squint than to not wear any pair of sunglasses at all. So if you guys are interested in picking these up, I am going to leave a link description down below where you guys can pick these up directly from Amazon. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I upload a brand new video, just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.